Hi all, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing my uh, Ipsy unbagging for two months for February and March. This is the February bag. It's got little lips on the zipper. And then I'm also going to be doing my March bag, which is like a um, rosy color, blush color I guess you'd call it. It's got a little rose gold uh, zipper on it. It's pretty cute. Okay. So, yeah, my bag was lost, and so they had to replace a couple items, so I didn't get the original ones that were in my first bag, but that's okay. I didn't mind it too much, except for one item, which I really was unhappy about, so I'll start with the bad first. Um, this is a Trust Fun Beauty uh, nail polish in the color that I'm wearing on my nails right now. It's called Elegantly Wasted. Now, as you can see, I have two of these. I've already gotten one in a previous bag, so I'm going to have to... Uh, maybe donate this one to somebody if you want it. Let me know in the comments Okay, so the next thing that I got in that bag was this NYX lip balm It's a butter lip balm in the color lady fingers It's a pretty color And it smells really nice Let me show you a little swatch here It's very pretty it smells like Maybe cherries. I think it's, it smells delicious. Okay, so the next thing that I got in this bag is this mascara. It's waterproof from Bella Pierre. I don't wear a lot of waterproof mascaras actually because they're really difficult to take off. And this one is still packaged because I'm going to wait until I'm out of mascara before I open another so that it doesn't dry out. Okay, so the next thing that I got in that bag is this Illuminizer. Woo! Can you see it? There we go. It's kind of a bronzy gold color. I'm going to put it here next to the lip balm. Here it is. It's nice to wear under your foundation, or you can mix it with your foundation to give you an extra glow. And if you have medium skin to darker skin, then you can wear it as a highlighter on the high points of your cheeks. I feel like I'm missing something here. Just a minute. Okay, and then the last thing that I got in that bag is this little snail. It's um, it's a ladykin snail cream. <laughs> anyway, it's really cute. I'll give it a shot. So that was all the things that I got in my February bag. Now on to my March bag. Okay, so we'll start with this skin cleanser. It's a gentle cleanser with sugar, mint, oats, and rice. Um, let me see how it smells. You can definitely tell there's mint in there. Um, and it's kind of like a jelly consistency, so I will try that tonight to see if I can remove my makeup with it. Okay, the next thing that I got is a City Color Color Corrector. It's like a peachy color. Um, it's very creamy and this is what it looks like. I'll see how I like it. Um, usually in in like this kind of formula it's too thick or stays too wet and then it clumps up with your uh, powder. I don't know. I'll give it a shot. See how I like it. The next thing that I got in this bag is this Dirty Little Secrets blush in the color Kitty Pink. Um, it says that it's pink, but it really looks more like a peachy color. I'll do a little swatchy swatchy here. It's very pretty. I'll definitely be trying a lot of these things tomorrow. Let you know if I like any of them a lot. Okay, the next thing that I got here is these tweezers from Chella Beauty. And they're kind of cute. I've never seen tweezers like this. This little finger spot here to hold on to them. They're a little bit thicker than I enjoy, but I will see. I always got hair to pluck, so 
tomorrow. I'll give it a shot. Okay, and then the next thing that I got in this bag is this TARDIS lip paint in the color Delish. And that's what I'm wearing on my lips right now. Mm. I didn't actually do a very good job. It looks a little bit crooked, but just wanted to try it out right away. I was really excited about this one, actually. Hee <laughs> hee. Anyhow, um, the next product is actually my last product, and it's something that I redeemed. It's an expensive product. Ooh. It's my Hourglass Ambient Light Correcting Primer. It, the color is ambient, I believe. Or, yeah, let me look at it. It says dim light, so maybe that's the color. Anyway, this is what it looks like. And I'm very excited to try this, especially with the foundation that I got uh, from Hourglass. But we don't have to wait a few months. I'll have to get some bronzing up done because the weather here is not very good. And that color is way too dark for me right now. I'm like about three shades lighter than that color. But, um... Yeah, that's all I got in my bags. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please click on the like. And if you're not a subscriber, subscribe if you liked it. So, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.